What's up, YouTube? Back for another video. Uh, this time, it's not me working on any of my cars. My wife and I went for a little mini vacation, just the two of us, and uh, we didn't just go for no reason. Uh, we went went to watch some, some vintage uh, car and motorcycle racing in Wildwood, New Jersey. So, um, I got three days worth of stuff that I'm kind of editing and going through and you know, you're not going to see it all or else I'd have like a freaking hour and a half plus long video. So, um, hope you enjoy it. I'm kind of, I'm going to edit quite a bit. Like, um, I don't know. I guess you'll see. So I hope you enjoy it. There's something about the nostalgia, the old paint or patina in most cases pinstriping, craftsmanship that goes into or went into every piece, the oil covered motors in some cases, or even the chrome ones, or the ones so clean you could almost eat off of them, the sounds, the smells, it takes you back to when people were proud of what they've built, a time where there wasn't any electronics, when times were simpler I guess you could say. The fact that these cars and motorcycles are still around and running today and that there's people out there who try to keep them up and running is simply amazing to me. Oh, and did I mention they race them on the beach? Like, and Hawk with that one going away. 
And away they go. 616 is a little foot power. They got going. There goes 79 bucket of Errol Hayes. Oh, there they go, ladies and gentlemen. There they go. Get to see all the grudge matches and pink slip races out here. Car in the near lane, risk the 575, beat car in the far lane. 38 car in the near lane, risk the 575, beat car in the far lane. Thirty-eight car in the near lane versus the five seventy-five B car in the far lane. Second racing action coming at you out here. Six seventeen car in the far lane versus the two B car in the near lane. There's an increased set of urgency out here. This is a seventy-three car in the far lane. 73 with the early lead. Will he hold on? And he does. 73. Yes. Johnny Hess from Brooklyn, New York. Oh, this could be a close one. Looks like it's the boy from Brooklyn. Out of France. Oh, with that number 11 bike. That's Lee Lewis. From Lake Peekskill, New York, you got a little bog down there. Number 10 going to win that one. Turn up the line. Turn away they go. 27 feet with that early jump. 
Can he hold on? He does. As this racing action heats up here, day two of the 2019 race of gentlemen. Can't do this part yesterday. Want to remind you to pick up your race gentlemen merchandise at the merch tent. This is Stay Gold Coffee. Get yourself a nice hot cup of coffee. We got a little lemonade stand going on over there. All the proceeds go to charity. Tasty food tents. Games for the kids. Thank you to all those drivers just made a run. It's really heating up. Everybody wants to take home some hard work. Go! It's going to be a close one. Ah, looks like Thelma! Versus the 911 car in the near lane. Jesse and Jean as the win. 